What's up? It's Vinny here, and yesterday I had a bit of fun playing Team Objective, so I just decided to um, record the next game I was going to play, and let uh, other people decide what we're going to play, and just play it and record it, and then upload it. Uh, I didn't get a chance to do it last night, so here I am, 9 o'clock in the morning, doing a commentary. My voice is a bit rough, but... Oh well, so as you can see here, people are voting and I am not influencing it at all. Um, <clears throat> the purpose of, of this video is pretty much to kind of show you how I think, what my thought process is during the game and why I, I make the plays I, I make. So um, we get Crazy King on Pinnacle, not my favorite at all because I'm not a big fan of Pinnacle. Um, and <laughs> to top things off as well, you'll see in a second, we uh, we end up losing a player, so it's three against four. Uh, with Crazy King, that's a really big dis disadvantage. So, but uh, we managed to uh, to do okay. Now, we yeah, we get into black screen here for a bit, so the the start of the game is pretty messed up. So I'm just gonna start it from here. I we get a red spawn, which is probably my favorite. So I get sniper. And uh, you're probably thinking about yourself now, like, oh, he's going to, he's going to camp up there the whole game. Uh, no, that is not my my way of playing, but I do believe if the hill is in the middle and I have a, snip, a sniper rifle, then why not sit there and um, and do some work, help my team out, teammates out as much as I can. Uh, so I'm putting shots and everything, and everything that moves. Uh, picking up a few double kills. Teammates have died now, so I'm trying to clear out the hill. <coughs> they have rockets, I can see. Uh, so I hope they don't shoot them up at me, but um, he ends up missing anyway. So They spawn below us, as happens on this map. Uh, luckily, we were able to take them out. Now, they're back in the hill, and I see my teammates moving up, so I decided to go and help them. I only have a few shots left on my sniper. And I like to play... Um, aggressive, so uh, I don't like to camp back in my base. <clears throat> I seen him sm spawning small tower, so I put shots on everything. Um, I probably, looking back on it, I should have shot the other guy who has a sniper. I didn't realize that fast enough, but uh, so he takes me out. <clears throat> now I know he's up there, and I see he's been sniping my teammates as well. So I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna let him see me. I use the uh, the rock to my right as a cover. Even though I do move out a bit, and uh, he's still up there sniping, and I try to put as much pressure on him as possible. <coughs> so they're spawning big tower now, and the hill's moved, which um, I, I'm not really sure what I was doing here. To be honest, I I didn't move at all. I just kind of stood there and and shot. But when I die, I like to switch over to my teammate's screen just to see what they're doing, and I see my teammate just picked up the enemy sniper there. Uh, so now I know that. That area should be safe enough, unless he dies, of course, which uh, I think he's he's about to. But um, the use of jetpack is quite annoying, especially on maps like uh, Pinnacle and Uncaged. Uh, it gives them a great advantage, and as you can see, uh, people uh, do like to use it. I die, unfortunately, here by a guy with a shotgun. Uh, this hill is kind of hard to control because you, you kind of have to sit mm, probably small tower with a sniper or else just roam around top mid so that's what I'm doing right now roaming around top mid and um, sloppy shots here by me and I didn't look for enough cover because the people in the, in the big tower just take me out no problem -o. now I know that the rockets have spawned because I keep an eye on the timer and my teammate gets them so that, that's okay as long as we have them I don't mind uh, I keep in mind it's three against four, and I know I know these guys aren't pro players or anything. Uh, pick up the ninja there, looking at the radar at all times. Um, but uh, still, three against four, it's it's always a disadvantage. Bad nade, nearly kill my teammate. Uh, pick up the kill there. Decide to go move away from the hill just to try to pick up the kills as the as the enemy comes towards us. Um. Now I'm looking for the spawn, and I think the spawning big tower. I I should have realized that earlier because now I'm one shot, and 
I can't really do much for my team, and they're gonna push me. So let's see what happens here. Bad shots by me. I should have killed that guy way earlier, and I should have not let myself be seen by that sniper. So now, now that I know that sniper is there, I'm gonna put as much pressure on him as possible. Uh, I think that's very important because when I'm sniping, I hate it when people are shooting at me. I think it's one of the most frustrating things. So there, and you can see, he, 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 I think he thinks I, uh, he thought I stopped shooting at, at him, so I, uh, I ducked away into cover and then came back out a few seconds later just to pick off the kill. Uh, I died there really stupidly. That's, I, I just, I hate those rockets. <laughs> um, so new sniper spawned, and I nearly, I nearly lose it to my teammate. Um, I, I think I go top mid because the hill is in that. Uh, in that walkway there, so I kind of want to get an advantage point looking down into it and I'm watching the spawns because I know they're going to spawn Banshee or Tower so yep they spawn Banshee pick up the double kill, pick up the triple looking for the exterm of course as always nowhere to be seen uh, so watching small tower spawn I, as you can see I, I'm always watching the spawns because well you want to get as much time as possible out of these hills and um the best way to do that is just by getting the, the enemy off spawn. Uh, I don't know what happened there. I thought I would have had him with the beatdown, but he stepped back. Uh, whether he meant to do that or not, I don't know, but it was a good play by him. Um, so now they're, they're all top mid, and I'm basically on my own here. So I I probably should not have pushed up here. I end up doing it anyway, and it works out for me. <laughs> Pick up the the triple, going for the exterior, but I get sniped in my face. So, as you can see, I've been I've been choking. I've kind of been choking all day when it comes to that. Uh, I spawn in a not very fortunate place, to be honest. Uh, I never want to spawn in the hill, but it happens. Um, so they're all chasing me here and try trying to get away. I actually do end up getting away. Uh, if well, I would have gone away if it wasn't for the guy right behind me right now. Um, I would have been able to, to finish those kills off, which is a bit of unfortunate because it would have been a nice play. Um, watching the spawns again, especially Big Tower. I'm not sure why that guy is chasing after my teammate, but I helped him out anyway. Um, as you can see, I, I try to put shots on everything that moves. It's just it's just so important, especially in King of the Hill. No, no, especially just in every game that you play, you just want to help your teammates out as much as possible. I'm, um, I really can't stand people who just sit in one spot with a sniper or with camouflage or something, and they just they think they're they're God's gift or something, you know. And they uh, they go for the big KDs. Uh, you get a lot of people playing big team battle, and I have nothing nothing against big team battle. Uh, I just I'm not a fan of people who uh, who play only to get like a four or five KD or higher. I think it's I think it's pointless. It doesn't show your skill off at all. It doesn't show um, any uh, any teamwork. Well, like you get you get teams in big team battle as well. I realize that, um, and they some of them are really good. It's just not my kind of play. So I get another unfortunate spawn into the hill. Um, all I can do here really is put shots on everyone because there is a sniper looking at us from the tower but uh, the game is over 3 against 4 we win by uh, by a large amount of points over half, no not over half but about, about half so um, I just, I'll just show the the post game screen getting frenzy, triple kill I end up going to uh, 34 and 11, so not bad overall. I think I helped out my team pretty good.